tell me you love neutrals without telling me you love neutrals this is going to be one of these uh, videos let's start i am at my uh, comfortable little uh, chair sipping uh, some greek coffee and i'm going to do an h m unboxing for you guys just received this box i'm super super excited with everything i've ordered in neutral colors and I will show them to you now first item is a white cotton shirt so I had purchased a white shirt from cause that I decided not to keep uh, the moment I saw this one because price wise of course we all know H&M and cause mm, different uh, price points um, but I wanted to give this a go and see how I feel about it it is 100% cotton i hope it's not too noisy i got it in small and i can see that this is from this range divided so let me show you the shirt i think i think it's beautiful and i was a little bit skeptical um, as to what size to order i ordered small uh, because I didn't want it to be too tight because that's not the effect I want in my uh, shirts I want them to be a little bit spacious a little bit you know on the cool kind of side um, and to feel a little bit manly if you know uh, what I mean uh, but medium then I thought oh maybe medium is too large and will show you know too big and then I'll have problem uh, on the shoulders but this um, size is perfect. I've mentioned uh, before in the past, I'm um, a size UK one, eight to 10. Uh, I fluctuate between uh, these two sizes. Um, small in H&M is perfect for me. And what I like in this shirt is that it comes with a little pocket on the left uh, breast uh, side. And it also has a button so cool so effortless um the sleeves are perfect very comfortable i think this is uh, a keeper i'm pretty sure a lot of people have purchased uh this uh shirt and remember the striped shirt from my previous h&m mahal i've been wearing it so much lately it's so comfortable so cool i love um the heaviness of the cotton and it was so below 20 uh, pounds which is amazing so the next item that i have in this call is an item that i had also in my previous one but i opted for a size smaller and this item uh, is the white linen trousers after i watched my previous h m haul the clip with um these uh, trousers on um I could tell that yeah they are a little bit see-through it didn't feel it didn't look rather see-through when I had them on and I was checking myself in the mirror but when I watched the video they are a little bit uh, see-through um, today I've uh, put them on I've tried them on with beige underwear and I do feel that they are a little bit uh, better and this size which is a size 12 last time in the last video I've ordered size 14 which was huge size 12 is a lot uh, better i'm gonna quickly show you um, the trousers they are tapered ones which means that they are the perfect length for uh, me uh, voila big pocket at the back and uh, uh, just to mention again that this is a linen blend so it's not 100% linen um, and this is uh, the reason why uh, the H&M ones of course they are way cheaper if we compare them to um, the cost ones but as I mentioned in my last video the cost black linen trousers which by the way I'm wearing today have ripped <laughs> i just refused to throw them uh, away um, and i decided to keep them and wear them in the house because they are brand new uh, but they've ripped anyway 
The next item from the haul is a pair of black leggings. I've read so many amazing reviews for these leggings that they're so cheap and since I don't have a pair of leggings, um, I wanted to try them. I just wanted to try them and see what's the fuss all about. It's so beautiful that they come with this thick waistband that really sucks you in and keeps everything where they should be originally. But sometimes they misbehave and they are not. So for these uh, times we have <laughs> these leggings. I really like them. Um, they are hardly see-through. Again, you have to wear the right underwear, you know, under it. And when I'm wearing leggings, in all honesty, I do wear them with something quite long. And the idea behind ordering this uh, was to wear them in the fall, winter as well, uh, with um, that cost jumper that I purchased last year from cost I mentioned it uh, the one with the thick stripes white and black ones turtleneck uh, that is giving total to 10 vibes so I want to wear a pair of black leggings with sweaters um, like this I think it's a cool uh, vibe and then you throw your um, coat or whatever you're wearing on top on and you are good to, to go and you look so uh, effortlessly chic. I love these leggings, so so cheap. Um, I'm light, I'm, I'm quite late in that uh, leggings game, but I'm here. Next item is this t shirt. Can't remember when was the last time I purchased a t shirt from HM. I, I can't remember, but I saw that it's again a striped top. I do have quite a few in my wardrobe, but when I say stripes, I just can't resist them. The size is small. Let's see. Oh, beautiful. Oh, this is quite uh, short, I would say. Yeah, they are quite short. That's fine. It's, uh, it's okay. So they say Paris. And if Kay is watching this, have I told you that I love Paris? Uh, yes, we oui, oui, oui is the answer because I'm obsessed with Paris. I love Paris. Um, I could I could go to Paris every week, but yeah, it's not happening. Therefore, I just got myself a Paris uh, t-shirt. Paris stripes, check check. Good to go. It's all cotton, very um, affordable. But I think that size medium would be oops, <laughs> would be better uh, for me. Um, yeah, food for thought. I think this is a little bit um, tight. Yeah, food for thought. Let's see. The last item is a piece, an outwear piece. So I've never had a trench coat before. And I saw this on HM.com. It is cotton, um, only the lining is polyester, which Mm, I'm kind of okay uh, with it and I just wanted to to order it and see it let's see what size I have ordered I haven't tried it on before so the size that I've got is size small because sometimes I think yeah coats and trench coats and in, in general um, uh, outwear tend to be a little bit generous so I didn't want to go for a medium so let's get small, let's try it on and take it from there. It comes in two colors, in black, and this is the beige version. Let me show you the color. So let's see the size first. Okay, it is a little bit crisp, but I think the size is good. I'm gonna stop the video, try them on. Okay, let's evaluate the size. So I would start by saying that the sleeves are quite generous. Uh, so you can see how they look. I don't know if it would look good to fold them like that. I think it destroys the design a little bit, but it doesn't look 
too bad. They are a little bit long, I think, uh, for me. So size-wise, I think, again, it's a little bit generous, but this is a kind of outwear that you don't want it to be uh, too tight and you want you will be wearing a little bit heavier clothes underneath so you really value the space that it will uh, give you so i love the pockets and this is the back i love the detail here of course it is super super crisp and i haven't had the chance to fix it and these are the details uh, here and it also closes here yeah so we have the belt as well which is removable and if we tie uh, the belt the belt is quite long so if we do it like that without buttoning the buttons because who has the time to button the button so if we tie it like that this is how the size feels. What do we think? Do we like? Let me know. So of course this trench coat is not your Burberry trench, uh, trench coat. Uh, the quality and the price are worlds apart or even planets apart in all honesty. But I think it's important that it is cotton. And after I purchased it, I was um, reading these uh, fashion articles online on who, what, where, Vogue as well. And uh, they were uh, doing articles about outwear trench coats and this specific trench coat was featuring in every single article. Uh, they were all, the editors were also highlighting the fact that it is so cheap uh, I will include the price uh, I got it with 25% off uh, because on H&M.com when you have your birthday they give you a 25% discount uh, for one item and I decided to use uh, the discount code for this piece of clothing so I got it really really cheap and of course as I said earlier there were there are two colors one that I got they call it beige and the black and because i don't have another trench coat i thought let's opt for the beige one i wasn't very sure of how the color will show because you see one color on the website sometimes in reality the color is slightly different i would if you ask me i prefer better the taupey beige colors than this one but it's not uh, bad and I think for black if I wanted to get a black one maybe I can get it uh, in another brand but again this is food for thought um, I'll evaluate all the pieces from the haul I'm keeping the white linen trousers because uh, I think uh, the, the size was perfect and the leggings uh, as well and the shirt which I loved the t-shirt I think I need to go a size uh, up so this was today's uh, haul I need my caffeine fix to uh, function uh, properly and I didn't mention this beautiful linen waist uh, coat that I'm wearing uh, today it's a little bit revealing uh, here but that's okay I could could wear it with a t-shirt but I'm feeling quite hot uh, today so I opted to go with nothing underneath it is from the white uh, company I think it's size 12 uh, I think white company sizes are a little bit uh, funny uh, slightly different to sizes from other brands that we all know but hey ho it was on sale it is 100% linen the linen is super super uh, soft I love the buttons as well if you can see see them and it was a good price i didn't have uh, a linen waistcoat and i bought it and i'm super happy about it thank you for joining me uh, on this uh, video guys i hope you enjoyed um the haul let me know your thoughts on the items i hope to see you in my next one and as always thank you so much for being here watching my videos 
and supporting me. Ciao guys. <music>